Netflix is one of the most popular streaming platforms in the world and it has amazing war movies being added to the service on a regular basis. And this video will give you my recommendations of 5 excellent war movies that you can watch on Netflix right now. Most of these are films which are Netflix originals so they should be available in pretty much all regions. But before we begin, don't forget, if you love anything to do with historical TV shows or historical movies, then subscribe to my channel, History Spark. At number 5, it is The Forgotten Battle, a World War II film which depicts the Battle of the Scheldt in 1944 through the viewpoint of three characters, a British pilot, a Dutch Axis soldier, and a resistance fighter. The Forgotten Battle benefits from strong acting by the entire cast and an engaging and harrowing plot with non-stop plot twists and turns. The few minor critiques I had with this film though is the huge number of characters that got introduced, making it hard to keep up with all the names and people in the film. And the script was pretty weak as well, but that could also be in part to a lot being lost in translation when converting dialogue to subtitles. If you have a Netflix subscription, then The Forgotten Battle will be a great World War II film that you should add to your watch list today. And number 4, it is Siege of Jadotville, which is a war film based around the events that led up to the Siege of Jadotville, where a unit of Irish soldiers were besieged by Catanese forces during the United Nations operations in the Congo during 1961. This is a tense and brutal film in which we see firsthand the struggles fears and tensions that arise in the Irish camp due to the ongoing siege. The movie also does a great job of keeping the viewer engaged throughout the whole film with a mix of great action scenes, dialogue and acting. So if you're looking to find out more about a very little known about battle, then Siege of Jadotville is my recommendation for you. At number 3, it is All Quiet on the Western Front, a Netflix original World War I film which follows Paul Borner and his friends who naively join the German army as they have a romanticized version of war in their heads and it is propaganda that the German government and army are just too happy to continue to fuel. But as the movie progresses, these young men lose their innocence as they experience the horrors and trauma of war and the physical and mental impact it has on them. This movie has amazing acting, a great story, and a fantastic sense of realism. This movie is cold, calculated, and it shows the Germans as more than just the big baddies or an evil force. They were a group of individuals who didn't know what they were getting themselves into, and had no choice but to follow the commands of their generals. If you love war movies, then All Quiet on the Western Front will be the perfect film for you. The second spot on this list goes to Fury, a war film focusing on a fictional US tank squad near the end of World War II in Europe. This movie portrays how difficult and risky it was being part of a tank crew due to the high casualty rates suffered by armored tank units. Fury benefits from a great plot, great acting and some amazing battle scenes as well. But this film does get regularly hated on for the huge number of historical inaccuracies and some obvious plot holes. But if you want a brutal, unforgiving and action filled war movie, then Fury is the perfect recommendation for anyone with a Netflix subscription. The top spot on this list goes to The Bombardment, a Netflix original movie which focuses on a very little discussed topic about World War II and that is about the horrific times when things don't go to plan and friendly fire occurs causing the deaths of your own allies rather than your enemies. And the harrowing events that occurred on March 21, 1945 is one such example of this when the British Royal Air Force attempting to bomb a Gestapo headquarters in Copenhagen accidentally targets a local school and the surrounding area which results in the death of at least 80 children. The bombardment gives the backstory of the events leading up to this mishap and the horrific aftermath that would follow. The bombardment is an emotional and at times difficult movie to watch, but it doesn't shy away from telling the truth behind these events and is an eye opener for a little talked about tragedy at the hands of the allied forces. So lastly I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video, if you did enjoy it please do like and share this video with others. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe to my channel History Spark as I post videos on historical TV shows and historical movies each and every week. Thank you so much for watching.